Oh hey, welcome to this intimate session of Technique Tuesday. My name's still Ryan and this is Tapey McTape Tape. We're gonna take you through one of the fundamental steps in waltz, tango, foxtrot, Viennese, and I'm sure a plethora of other dances too. Let's get sticky. We've got ourselves some lovely tape lines to practice what is called the change step. The change step is simply two half boxes moving forwards and then two half boxes moving backwards. This change step gives us the opportunity to practice great timing, fantastic technique, and it also gives us the opportunity to practice our rise and fall and our posture. Let's have a look at it, shall we? Your steps for this one are forwards on the left foot, side on the right foot, and feet together. Forwards on the right foot. Side on the left foot, and feet together. Backwards on the left foot, side on the right foot, feet together. Backwards on the right foot, side on the left foot, and feet together. Now there are some advanced concepts that you can add into the change step in order to challenge yourselves if you are an advanced dancer. One of the first things we can put in is to focus on how to connect the foot to the ground. Remember, moving forwards, a heel-toe contact point to the side is a toe-only connection point, and as we draw our feet together, it is a toe-heel lowering action. Heel-toe, toe-toe-heel. We have a toe-heel, toe toe heel connection point. It's also worth noting that I am producing a heel pull action in order to keep myself stable. Toe heel with a heel pull. Toe, toe heel. We can also incorporate elements of our adducting episode that we did a couple of weeks back. As I take my side step, I'm gonna make sure that I pull my leg underneath my hips, underneath my body weight in order to control my action and make the whole movement look a lot smoother. One, two, pull the leg, three. So this has been another episode of Technic Tuesday. Thanks again, guys. Ah, I wish I had.